right, y'all. Welcome back, man. For those of you who are new to this series, basically what we do here is we analyze gameplay. We look at some of the decisions the player made of some of the top players in the world. We see what type of teamwork they're working with. And basically, we just look at what they're doing well and try to analyze what makes them so great and basically see how we can replicate that. What can we take from the video and what can we learn from these type of videos? So if you enjoy the video, be sure to subscribe to the channel. Drop that thumbs up on it. And yeah, let's see. Let me know. Leave some of your thoughts in the comments section. Let me know some of the things that you all see. But yeah, let's, let's get into it, man. Let's jump right into the gameplay. So his name is Gosu Gosu Crit. We all know who Gosu is. Um, hopefully, and yeah, look at this guy. So many stars, eighty percent win rate. Definitely not a solo player. They definitely be squatted up. Let me see. Let's look at. Let's look at um the squad he he's rocking with right now. Looks like he's with a three man team. Most most top players, and also notice that I want you all to notice most top players are with three man teams more than they're with five man teams. Because three men is all it takes to really carry a game, honestly. And it's easier than trying to go 5v5 versus four teams with tryhards and stuff. So, yeah, most people just like to go with the threes. Um, and let's see. Yes, but let's look at the team comp here. So, we have Lancelot, Diggy, Harley, Lolita, and Saber. So, this is an interesting team comp. You have a... I mean, you don't have too much crazy damage here, but all together... Well, actually... um. Lancelot and Harley is pretty pretty freaking crazy. And then you got two heroes that can counter people, but let's see who they're countering. That, that, this is actually a weird pick. So they're going against Grok, Lapu, Gajan, and Change, and Leslie. So there's really nobody here who, who needs to be countered by those two. But, hey, I mean, I guess basically Gajan is going to be in for a long game. He's basically the only one worth even focusing on, for, worth even targeting. I mean, Leslie can get good. But that's only late game. So early game, she's probably going to get smacked anyway. <laughs> so yeah, Gajan is in for a long game. He's going to be the one. Like Personally, he is who I would focus. If I saw this type of matchup, I would be focusing Gajan all game. The timing though, really? Look at that. You saw how um, Diggy just threw that over there and knew exactly when he was going to spawn? Bro, that's how you know. That's how you know when you're a pro player, you literally take the time to learn the timings of everything. You know when everything's going to spawn. All that stuff is very important depending on what level you want to play at. But yeah, that's pretty cool. Look at that. They knew that was coming next. Taking that out very quickly. Yeah, the enemy team couldn't even get back in time. Clearing out the wave quick. Hey, don't touch the hair. Yo, Diggy allows for some very, very fast farming. I really haven't looked into Diggy much. I didn't know he could just... Well, I knew he could explode stuff, but at this rate, the rate that he's taking stuff out, that's crazy. Looks like they're trying to gank. Oh, I thought Lapu was going to walk in there through them bushes. That would have been tragic for him. Lapu there just chilling. It's still a long way from beating me. Uh, he might be dead. Why Why is he going towards them? <laughs> why He got hit with that ring. The second I got hit with that ring, I would have bagged up. But he just walked towards them. So, obviously, the, the people they're playing against are clearly not at the same level as them. Um, so, that's, that's yeah, that that's apparent. Getting the jungle. They're getting the jungle creeps and everything. Then getting turtle as well. They're they're out farming them like crazy right now. They're getting everything. They got crab. They're getting turtle. They got their whole jungle. This is this. They're they're clearly outclassed right here. The other team is outclassed by far. Even though Gajan Gajan is jumping in, and getting some work done. He might be able to take Harley. Harley has already used his ultimate. Nah. He was too low. He was too low. And Lapu just literally stood there and watched him. He didn't come over there and try to help. <laughs> so that was that was a weird decision, man. Lapu was in the bush while his homie was still up fighting them, but he didn't even attempt to try and help his teammate. Like no teamwork coming from the other side. Honestly. 
this this team right here, they're playing basic. They're like, Gosu is playing really basic right now. They're, they're doing what they're supposed to do. And this this is what's crazy. Like, simply because the other team doesn't seem to know the fundamentals, this game is probably going to go badly, and they're really going to keep getting destroyed. No fundamentals, no teamwork, no supporting each other, terrible positioning. <clears throat> Harley's going to get... Harley's going to get fed by taking a buff. Well, get some health and stuff back. Look at that. Literally just outplayed both of them right there. And they're probably going to end up killing him too. That Lapu definitely isn't the best Lapu. And they're, they're, they're going to invade now? They're going to invade and take their jungle? Oh no, somebody over there is doing well jungling. If I had to guess, it's Gajin. Gajin's the only one from that side where I've seen he shows some potential. Honestly, at this point, this really isn't even a game. <laughs> this isn't a game. This is just... This is bullying. Is this allowed? <laughs> Can they do this? This is bullying at this point, Joe. But yeah, Gosu is honestly playing great, but um, I don't even know if Gosu has the best team comp here, man. I, I think that the other team could have really got a better team comp than that could really stop Gosu. But, I mean, their lack of teamwork. They can't work together. And when you have a team, teams that can't work together and they're really playing this poorly... I mean, you can basically use anybody and beat them. As we're seeing here, like, Gosu's comp isn't bad, but it's not the best. And it's 12 to 2 right now. And and we have saw how, how it got to this point. So, basically, the way it's been getting to this point is you've had um, Lapu out of position most of the time. A lot of them getting out of position a lot of the times. Really, the only one I've been seeing rotating and trying to do something is Gashin. Gashin is, like, as you just saw him right there, he was towards the top. He's been towards middle. He's been bottom lane. Um, Well, coming towards bottom lane, trying to help out. Right, it seems like Gashin is a one-man team right now. We'll look at the stats at the end of the game so we can really tell what's been going on, but... Yeah, this, this seems to just be a bully fest right now. But um, Crit is having a great game. They can take that tower down. They're going to take that tower down. Oh, they caught somebody slipping. They caught Lancelot slipping. Leslie's not fed yet. Like, like I said, it's not much Leslie can do. <laughs> Leslie is going against two assassins right now and Harley. Yeah, there the Leslie was Leslie was destined to get bullied this game. With a saber, a Gajan. I mean not a saber and a Lancelot. Le um Leslie was destined to get bullied. Leslie just cast a questionable ultimate. You're still a long way from being like what was what was the point of that ultimate? Cause she wasn't checking to see if anybody was close. Cause the her tower right in front of her would have told him that Harley was close. And now that the, now that the enemy team is finally trying to get together, the other team is 17 kills ahead. At this point, nothing can be done. You you start seeing some teamwork at um when they have seventeen kills you finally start seeing them trying to work together yeah this this just wasn't this wasn't played very well by the other team at all honestly it it, it's, it seems like 
the other team's mistakes stand out more than than Gosu playing well. <laughs> like it's that the 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 mistakes are just so bad. They're like so. I would say these are warrior mistakes. And honestly, we we just yo low key we just played in in warrior rank. We played with bots and all type of stuff. <laughs> they was honest. What, was they not better than this? Like yo, be completely honest. If you caught my streams when I was just playing through warrior ranks on my new account, where the warriors not like well, they weren't even making these type of bad decisions. Man, that's tragic. Another ultimate just blasted out for no reason by Leslie. You can't hide from my attacks. Mega kill. Taking out Leslie again. Leslie's out of there. <clears throat> the tank is down. Don't touch the hair. And Lapu can't defend that by itself, so this is definitely game. Look at this. <laughs> yeah. You're still a long way from Twenty-seven to three, yo. Oh, they gonna keep it going. They want more than twenty-seven. Twenty-eight to three. <laughs> All right, man. So that was just, yeah, that, I don't know. That that was pretty bad. But um, let's see. We had Lancelot going crazy. Lancelot dropped 13 kills. Um, the tank had 17 kills. So that was pretty dope as well. Um, guys, go to um, Diggy. My phone just vibrated, so it made me lose my train of thought. But um, Diggy just dropped 11 assists. Like, look, it was just basic teamwork from the other team the whole time. Like, literally, basic team worked the whole time. And let me see what Gajin did on their team. Gajin got destroyed, but he has two assists. Like, he has two assists and he has one kill. And it seems like he was actually roaming around trying to help people out. It seems like he was the only one who kind of knew what he was doing. Um, but even that wasn't enough. It, it, it's clearly not going to be enough if your team is 0-8, 0-6, 1-4, 1-5. 1-5. Um, so... Yeah, this this just wasn't a good performance from this other team, honestly. Like the the other team, like I said, they stand out way more than the, than the great performance we saw from the other, from this team. So, um, let me know what you all think in the comment section down below. What did you take from this gameplay? What's some of your thoughts on it? Let me know in the comment section. Make sure you subscribe for more um content like this and other Mobile Legends conversations and stuff. Drop that thumbs up, and I'm gonna catch you all on the next one, fam. Peace out, yo. I'm on it. Can't fail for my family. I want it. So they'll never need hope or warning A break just something that I don't get